Hi, Michelle Seitz here. You're watching Quick Parts. Here's the scenario. You would like to make your life easier and create some text that you can automatically enter into various documents without having to recreate it over and over. Quick Parts can help you with this. When you create a Quick Part function, it will be stored in the building block gallery. Watch this video to learn how to create automatic text and store it in the Quick Parts function. First, you need to create the text that you would like stored in Quick Parts. Maybe you have a closing and printed name you use all the time. How about a company name or address, logo, or a combination of all of them? Whatever it is, you need to create it first. I have many documents in which I need to insert the name of my company. So type the text as I have done here and apply the characteristics such as font style, size, and color. If not already selected, highlight the text, go to the insert tab, and in the text group, click the down arrow on quick parts and select save selection to quick part gallery. When you do that, the create new building block dialog box is displayed. Give your text a name. If you want to see it, as soon as you click on Quick Parts, leave the gallery as Quick Parts. You don't need to change any of the other fields, so you can just click OK. Now, when you want to insert your text in another document, go to the Insert tab, click on Quick Parts, and click on the text. You can do this with many selections, but if you like a clean drop-down, or if you'd like to store it in the Auto Text feature, and create your own category to store them in, do the following. First, you need to add the auto text function to your quick access toolbar. Go to the Microsoft button, click on Word Options, Customize, click on All Commands, find the auto text function, click on it, and click Add. Since mine is already added, I don't need to click this function, but if yours is not already added, Click Add and say OK. You can see the auto text function on my Quick Access Toolbar. Here's a document with my company name and logo in a JPEG. And here is my address, phone, and email. And here's my closing and printed name and title. So I'm going to create text and store it in the auto text gallery with a separate category. Select or highlight the text or object. Click on the auto text function on the Quick Access Toolbar and click Save Selection to Auto Text Gallery. When the dialog box is displayed, enter a name, and this time make sure the Auto Text Gallery is selected. In the Category field, click the drop-down and select Create New Category. And click OK. Here's a tip. The categories will be listed in alphabetical order. If you want your category to be listed at the top, since the categories are in alphabetical order, name your category with that in mind. Here's another tip. If you put a space before your category name, it will be listed at the top. Then you just click on them as you need them. After you've entered all the information, click OK. Now click on Auto Text and your items are in the Auto Text Gallery. I'm going to add my address and my closing so they are available whenever I need them. Do this for all of your selections. Now when you click on the auto text function, you'll see them immediately. Click on them as you need them. To learn more about this subject, watch the auto text, building blocks, and galleries video. When you close Word, you will get a message asking you if you want to save the changes to the building blocks. Select Yes if you want these Quick Part functions available next time you open Word. And that is the end of this lesson, Quick Parts.